believed in Nanak different way. There are two Nanaks. Two. Before we log into his sound, his music, it's important for us to just basically understand a little bit. A Nanak pre-British era in India. The Nanak and his six, his students, they were Muslims, they were Hindus, they were Buddhists, they were yogis, they were sadhus, they were, they were poor and rich. Because Nanak never believed in the religion of any soul. He believed in humanity. He believed in your success and smile. He believed in your health. He wanted you to be strong and powerful. And he believed that your body is a shadow of your mind. And if you, if you can win the heart of your mind, life is going to be phenomenal. So I look toward the United States, the infrastructure, it gives me smile. I was actually talking to my students. The in West, people live Nanak's way. They are in a position to help others. So let's not imagine Nanak in India. Let's go searching for Nanak in our hearts. Nanak is a concept. Nanak is not a being. Nanak is smile. Nanak is only one word in English, if we understand. That word is called love. Love. If you know how to give the love, if you know how to be in love, if you know how to become the love, then you got all what Nanak wanted you to be. Let's celebrate a different way, reflecting from our life. And this music, the science I'm going to share with you is actually not music, not the music of entertainment, but this is all about inner attainment, inner communication. When you cry, have you ever cried? Yes. Do you cry in Hebrew? Do you <laughs> cry in Hindi or English? Do you laugh? And when you laugh, you don't laugh in English, do you? No. Nanak is talking about that sound, which is before the words. He wants you to feel it. And therefore, all of his work is subscribed in a Guru Mukhi which is not a language either. <coughs> it belongs to Spanish as much it belongs to American or English or Indian. So try this little time we have, try to open your heart, feel it. Let me do the spell of sound. And let's see the magic of it. It's so relevant. Even just we told you, and before I go into taking you into a journey, a beautiful journey, the power of your own ears and your inner wealth of healing, how quick <coughs> you turn your stress into success, is just phenomenal. So therefore, please just come out of these shells of Indian music or classical music or traditional music or spiritual music. Let's go basically into sound, try to feel what we are about to demonstrate. And we are not touching this. This is not ours. This belongs to Nanak. The science revived by him billions of years prior to his, his coming to India. The science existed. He just revived, restructured, reprogrammed. His clinical study took 239 years. He lived it and gave it to us. So I want you to, to claim this today. Take it with you in your heart. Trust me, when, when the wrong time is there and you're not sure, this will make a miracle. It'll show you how to make the right decision at the wrong time. You'll remember this piece. It will come and buzz in your head. That is the miracle. 
So let's let's do the magic show. The instruments of Nanak Guru. This is the rabab of the design by Guru Nanak in 1500s. As a three and the 519 years of this instrument, this instrument, the instrument you you see over there is by Guru Gobind Singh. 1684, he created this at Ponta Sahib. The instrument you see here on my left, Shaminder Singh is playing his court jodi, was created at Khadur Sahib by Satta and Balwan in the court of Guru Arjun, showcasing the left and right side brain, the rhythm. Sometimes you jog, sometimes you walk, sometimes you run, sometimes you smile, sometimes you get a little bit sad. All of these rhythms are showcasing through the jodi. Actually came from the Mardang, you will you'll hear the sound of that too. This was cut into two pieces by that. And I'm here with this instrument called Saranda. It was created by Guru Arjun, the fifth Guru of six. But this is, please don't take it as a musical little concert. <coughs> Try to open your heart. Listen to, listen to it with your heart. I'm not here to sell you or showcase none. You know it anyway. From people from government, people like Dr. Sidhu here, Paul John Taylor, and people invested into people. They're putting things together with their community for you. From your local mayor to, to the government. They're all trying to do something for it. And Nanak is no different. He's trying to do the same thing for you. He want you to be happy and healthy. A very small couplet. A small couplet from one or two lines of this composition. Because the time is restricted and I promised you that solution, the mantra for you to take home. So I'm going to just share a little bit, diverse Nanak. Nanak, as a citizen of planet Earth.
got the solution I was looking for it. I need to find it anywhere is a possible anywhere. I need to be healed, need to get back into my life. What I'm gonna do with these degrees where I can't even take a piece of bread and put it into my own mouth. I need to fix myself. So I'm looking for healing everywhere. And here Nana comes into my life. That's why he's irrelevant to me. I don't know about the religion the people have been talking about, the Sikhism. I have no understanding of that concept. I go to mosque, hang around with my Muslim friends. I go to temples and hang around with my Hindu friends. I go more to church than I get a chance to go to Gurdwara. But I don't find a difference. I don't. They're, these are the people who believe. These are the people who belong to some kind of concept. And that's my sangha, that's my congregation, that's my world. But I need more than that. I need a healing, I need fixture. How do I walk again? I don't want to be in a wheelchair. I don't want to be dependent on nurses. How do I again can walk to bathroom? So here Nanak comes handy to me. He says, if you can converse with your mind and bring mind on your line as your friend, in reality, not in illusion. You know, sometimes we think that we can fly. You know, and you write the song, I believe I can fly. It's a fine. But in dreams you fly like a butterfly. That's a dream. It's not reality. In Nanak's mantra called Satnam. S S T Satte Nam. These this just one sound Satte Nam. This is not Punjabi word. This is this doesn't belong to Sanskrit. Doesn't belong to Hebrew or English. This is the same sound as the sound of your cry. But what it makes in your life is a reality. That this is really who I am, my problem, and I'm not gonna lie to myself. Satnam is my reality. This is my reality. This is my world. I'm in a pain, but I'm enjoying it. I am really good, but I'm not enjoying it. Me in reality. That, that real you is so powerful. See, once you go to that, that point of reality, when you become that meditation, not that you're doing a meditation. This is where Nanak put me into a separate box. He said, don't, do not. Stop thinking about it. Don't do meditation. Don't. <coughs> Nanak says, no point doing meditation. And I'm saying, huh? Everybody's about meditation. He said, but you, no, 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 no. Don't do the meditation. So what do I do then? He said, become meditation. That by sleeping, by walking, by talking, by doing your job, whatever you do, you are there, not in and out. And this is his mantra, Satnam, being real, real. We're not here in this land in crisis. We're not. You're not in crisis. Yeah, things go up and down in everybody's life, but we're not in crisis. Let's invest into smile, being real, a real smile. Let's become that global community, that global village we've been dreaming about. So I would like you to, to sing with me, to long for that. Can you do that with me, please? So we're going to do Sapnam. This is the, the only uh, the, the sound I would like you to create. S-A-T-N-A-A-M. 
है सत नाम दैट डजेंट रियली मैटर वेयर आर यू फ्रॉम एंड हु यू आर वी आर ह्यूमन वी शेयर द टीयर्स एंड जॉय हैप्पीनेस वी फील द सेम पेन वी आर ह्यूमंस बट व्हेन इट कम्स टू द सॉल्यूशन ही सेड नंबर 1 बी रियल डियर एंड he pushed me into reality i'm sitting amongst you guys fixed with the hand with the help of my mind everything everything i needed everything the last time i saw a doctor except last night i met dr sidhu at the gurdwara sahib but not not went to his surgery but yeah i meet doctors like this the last time i went to doctor It was in 1989 when they were visiting me in a hospital that's your power and i would like you to to be very 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 healthy people because then you can make this planet beautiful right so let's say bye bye to stress and tiredness and fatigue fatigue and sickness let's remove that let's be happy and again let's have a party who knows we have tomorrow or not let's enjoy it and to enjoy it to have a party nanak's way it's it's very crucial very special for you to be real you know it's okay to be sad you know it's okay sooner you see it you'll come out of it <coughs> so let's log in few minutes sing with me just close your eyes open your heart is your time to do the concert i'll just play a little bit sing along i'm really longing to listen to your voice hey okay? so join me sing satnam yeah satnam mean oh my dear mine i really 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 want to be with you let's come let's hold the hand let's do party <laughs>